your timeline or notifications real soon. Sounds good. Yeah, it says live on Facebook. I see it. Okay, good. I'll just do the introduction to give you time to add it and then we'll get started. All right. Hello, everybody. Happy Friday. This is Tiffany with the Speak Up and Inspire series. And we are back for our third business opportunity today. And I'm really excited to do this business opportunity because it's with Miss Ashley of Color Street. Um, if you are a young lady, if you are a woman, if you have girls living in, in your house, then this is definitely a great opportunity for you to get into because right now I know with all of the salons being closed, if your nails are looking like mine, see, I've got like broken nails and all this kind of stuff going on, then you right now are fiending to get your nails done. So this is a really good opportunity for everybody. If you know any women or any girls in your life, or you know what, any of the fellas, you might want to do your nails too. So this is a good opportunity. And so I'm excited about it today. So we have Miss Ashley with us. Hello, Miss Ashley. How are you? Hello. Good. 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 Tell us about Color Street because before I met you, I had no idea what Color Street was. So tell us what Color Street is. So Color Street's been around for a couple of years. It started in um, June of 2000. 17, I believe. So it's been almost a few years now. It'll be three years in June. Um, and it started with a gentleman um, named Saw Park. And he was on the um, train station on a subway and a lady was doing her nails and trying to hold the thing in her mouth and try to paint them. And it just, oh, yeah. <laughs> so if you've ever tried to paint them on a bumpy um, train ride or, you know, in your car, it doesn't work very well. So he came up with what he called Color Street. <laughs> no um or when kids are like all over you like I definitely all over me and they bump you and you're like oh gosh I have to start all over so he created a product called color street which is dry nail polish it's made in the United States in um actually in New Jersey so just up the east coast and um we it's been an amazing company um I started in October 18 and just been having fun with it um, I had my nails done. Let's see if you can kind of see it looks sparkly. Yeah, um, so, um, that's a little bit about Color Street. The price point is really fun. Um, they're anywhere from eleven to thirteen dollars a set, which uh, one set can do your fingers and your toes. And they're always buy three get one free. So that's another perk. So you can spend about forty dollars and get four different colors, which can last you um they last up to two weeks um I am a stay-at-home mom I have four kids so lots of dishes lots of cleaning um and they actually last me longer than regular nail polish. so that's a little bit about the product I did bring some to kind of show you if you guys want to see what you get in one do you want to see what you get in yes, one I would. Let's, okay. let's see let's see so this is we have two we have um a pedicure set we have regular set and then we have petite, um, which are for your um, preteens. So, um, yep, this is Color Street. Okay. Can you see me okay? Yep, I, I can see you. Awesome. <laughs> I can't see me anymore. <laughs> so, okay. I'm going to open up a set and hopefully you guys can see okay. So in a set, you got um, 16 nail strips. So there's two of each size here. So when um, these were created, they were tested um, size-wise on a lot of women to figure out the perfect sizing for us because we all have different size fingers. So these, you basically compare to what size they will fit on your fingers through here. Like I said, there's 16 of them. So there's actually two sets of each. Um, this one is a little big for me, so I can wear this on my toe, but this is like a perfect size for my thumb versus like mm -hmm. you have 
smaller pinky over here and that's way too small for me but it probably would fit a teenage girl um, or even um, someone with a lot smaller hands than me. So you get those, you get a prep pad. So this is just an alcohol wipe. I like to wash my hands with just on dish soap um, instead of using alcohol wipes, but this is if I'm in the car, it just cleans off any oils that you have on your hands. So okay. they stick. Okay. Um, like at a salon, when you wash your hands, they make you, or oil lotion, you have to wash your hands before any polish on. Same concept. And then you get a cute little nail file. That's a little pad. Nice. Color straight. And that's all that's in your kit. So this is everything. Pretty simple, pretty easy. Um, and that's the same stuff that comes in the pedicure set and then the petite set. So I um, also have, this is what a sample would look like. It's actually two strips. Mm -hmm. So if you ever want a sample, you can drop um, info in the comments and I can message you and send you out one. Um, but this is just for you to apply to two of your nails and test it out with regular nail polish, because I can tell you till I'm blue in the face that this is amazing product, but if you don't try it, you may not believe me. <laughs> right. So this is a sample. You would just paint the rest of your fingers with normal nail polish and kind of compare. So I have those to send out. Nice. Uh, nice. Now I know that when you sent a pack to, um, heaven, and my daughter is uh, 12 years old. So when I received the sample pack that you sent out to, to us, it was very easy to put on. So can you kind of walk us through the steps of how to put them on? So I ended up getting this, um, this set out. I was saving it for this. So um, we also have clear coats that kind of go over the nails and like mm -hmm. clear designs. So this one is just, um, a uh, cute little line design. It's actually clear and then black lines. So you can see there is a clear coat on the top mm -hmm. that off, and it just protects the nail strip. Then from there, there's a silver tab. I'm doing this for my camera. So the silver tab that you pick up. So this is your nail strip. All right, it's pretty simple and easy. I take off this little tab and then I'll turn my finger around in a second. You actually place it on the top like this. Mm -hmm. You're gonna smooth it down on your nail. And then I take my thumb and you can use a file. There's different ways, but I press underneath and then my nail is done. So I just add yeah. that. If you have leftovers, I put it on the other finger because I don't like to waste and my nails are short. Mm -hmm. So the same concept, I push underneath my fingernail. And if there's any access, I just file it down, but that's it. So I added the little accents and yeah, pretty simple. And then from here, I can get into my purse. I can get into my car. I can pretty much do whatever I need to and not worry about it smudging or getting all over something else. Very nice, very nice. So, yeah, so it's very, very um, easy to do. Um, I know my daughter had no problem doing it herself. Um, so definitely, if there are some young ladies out there, always encourage people to start their own business um, with something that they're passionate about. So my sister, my sister, sorry, my daughter is very much into nails and makeup and so forth. So. Um, this would be not just a good business for us ladies, but also we have a lot of youthpreneurs right now who are wanting to start their own businesses. So I can see this being a really good business for our teenage daughters, um, young adults as well. I don't know. I'm sure that if I go on my phone book right now, I probably have a hundred women like that will, that want to get their nails done or do something with their nails. So it's definitely a product that, that sells. So can you tell us about the business opportunity and how you got into this? So it all started, um, we always say, it all started with a twosie. So this is the accent nail and someone mailed me this and okay. I fell with it. So I said, why not? Um, I'll sign up and see how it goes. And I wasn't really thinking this was gonna pursue as a career. Um, mm -hmm. It was something fun, it was a hobby. Um, and just signed up. The kit is only $129. So it's not mm -hmm. um, 
overpriced kit, you get um, 13 sets, so full sets in your kit. Um, okay. You get um, 72 of these little accent packs in there that you can start handing out to friends. You get catalogs, um, some flyers, nail files. So you get everything to really start your business. Um, this, like I said, startup cost is 129. Now you do have to be 18 or older to start the business. Okay. Um, a mom and daughter can do it together. Um, if mm -hmm. you have a kid who wants to do it, um, that would be, I don't know, my teenager loves to help me and she goes live with me and um, has fun. So that's really the startup cost. Um, the monthly fee is $9.95 and that's just your website. Um, okay. But that's an awesome, I mean, it's really reasonable to have a website. So you just go on the website and order um, and it ships directly to the customer. So you don't have to have inventory. You don't have to have like a stock or anything. They can actually order offline. Now it's crazy right now. Um, our uh, stock is a little scarce online. And part of it is we're just operating at a half staff, which is a lot of people around here are kind of not operating at a full staff just with everything right. going on. Um, it takes about, um, I believe 10 days to make one of these sets. So okay. it takes a while for them to cure and get ready. But um, yeah, that's pretty much the business. You can um, sell to your friends, your family online. Um, yeah, pretty much anywhere. I have some people that sell to their friends from their cars. They meet up in parking lots and say, here you go. Like it's so versatile and you can take it. It's so small. You can just pop it right. in your purse and get with you anywhere. So good. So how long have you been um, a color street rep? I start, I started in October 2018. So oh, it'll be two years in October. So not quite two years. Nice. Now, do you do this um, full time? Do you have another job or how, how does this work in your schedule? In my schedule. So I fit it in where I can. Um, a lot of stuff I do is social media. So on Facebook, um, a lot of my parties are on Facebook or Instagram. And I really post when I can. Of it's right late before I go to bed, early in the morning. Um, if I'm waiting in a car rider line just wherever I can fit it in is normally how I do it. Um, but I'm a stay at home mom. I homeschool four kiddos. So I am pretty busy. So I yeah. try to fit where I can. Yes. Yes, indeed. Yes. Okay. So um, if everybody can go ahead and I would definitely recommend looking up the color street nail designs because they're, they're really beautiful, very funky, very classy, very, very colorful. I mean, anything that you would like as far as colors are, Color Street has it. So um, when you were talking about your daughter and I was saying earlier, this would be a good opportunity for um, young ladies to do this. And it would be great to do this with your, with your daughter as well. I know that a couple of people are watching right now who have daughters, so this is a good opportunity to get your, your daughters um, started with doing their own business, even though you have to do it with them. But one thing about this is that when kids like something, they spread the word. So definitely doing this with your daughters would be a great thing. And I know that you said that you, your daughter gets involved as well. How, how does she enjoy doing it? And do you find that it's easy for her to, to, to do this as well? So she's gone live with them and showed her crap. Obviously, um, Teens will, they love nail polish. I have several um, older teens that will apply them. They have their own little stash going and then mom kind of gets involved going, oh, I think we might do this together. <laughs> Me and my daughter share sets. So if I get, you know, this full package here, we could share this together and probably do one of our toes. So there's enough in there for to be able to share with a friend or share with a daughter. Um, so I made it kind of fun. I had some friends, um, do it for a birthday party she ordered several sets and they got to have fun and swap them out and because on this one I have several different colors like a couple different colors so uh -huh. it's nice to have a few sets you can kind of play around with and do your own little designs and have fun with so and we do keep up on the latest fashion um that's one thing that we do every year is um we look up the fashion trends that are going to be um coming to the states and um do our best to fulfill find a design that's going to um, really pair up with those fashion trends. Um, tie dye's coming back, um, mm -hmm. a lot of brighter colors, you know, your mints, your teals um, are coming back. So we have some of those styles and 
we love glitter. Um, I was not a nail polish person, but as soon as I saw the glitter and started wearing it, um, that's okay. Kind of shades are glitters. Um, <laughs> I will always have something on my fingers. So. Very nice, very nice. So the big question I know when we talk about business opportunities, you said that it was only 129 to start off and get your kit, which is a great price. Um, and I know a lot of people right now are, are not working or have been laid off, so forth and so on. So can you tell us about the compensation? Is it, how do you get paid? Is it a weekly thing? Is it a monthly thing? How do people get paid um, being a rep with Color Street? Well, I Sales and everything kind of depends on each person. So that's one as far as like monthly income or how much you're going to make. It really depends on how much you put into the business, how much um, you're wanting to. So you can make very little, just something to pay for your coffees, um, maybe a little bit more. And that's just in the roundabout. But um, you get 25% commission off of everything you sell weekly. And um, on top of that, um, monthly, you can earn um, more commission based on your sales versus 600. Um, if you sold 600, you get an extra 3% and so forth all the way up. So you can potentially earn up to 35% commission um, on your sales. And that would come a monthly. So if you go above and beyond, like the minimum base is 300, that's kind of the goal. Um, you do have six months to fulfill that 300 in one month. So if you just want to sell it, some people just sell it in the summer and for Christmas, like Mother's Day and Christmas, that's all they want to do. Right. Um, you'd still get that 25% um, each month. Does that? Got it. Okay. Got it. Got it. Okay. So you, you join, you sell, and you get paid monthly on your commissions on your sales. Is that correct? Yep. Okay. Yep. Got it. Got it. So when it comes to this business, and I know that you and I have talked to what what would you say are some of the the perks of being a color street rep um for me it really i started out because i wanted the friendships and i really want to do something for me and to mm -hmm. feel like a good mom so uh, that was another reason why i started um a lot of us girls are just have become really close friends um mm -hmm. i do have a small team of girls that um i get to coach and mentor and we've just built really great friendships. Um, the obviously the, the little bit of added income just helps in general. I can pay for my coffees and the little things I can pay for sports for my kids and stuff. So that's um, added fun. The company does offer sometimes um, like incentives. So um, they offered us jewelry. If we had certain goals, we would get jewelry for free. So those are some things the company does offer on occasion. Um, so. Yeah. Very nice. Very nice. Good. Well, I want to say thank you to you, Miss Ashley, for taking a moment out during your busy schedule. It's a Friday afternoon. <laughs> I know we're gearing up for the weekend. Um, I really think that Color Street, they have beautiful designs. Um, so how can a person get in contact with you if one, they want to be a rep or they just want to see the designs and would like to, to shop on your website. How can they get in contact with you? So you can message me. Up. Um, I'm obviously tagged the video um, or I'll put in my comments, um, my email, but um, I kind of, I bought my card. I can kind of show, I don't know if you can see my card, but it's Jenny's crew um at gmail.com or colorstreet.com slash jemmy is my website i think i left that but i will put some more info in the comments so really just message me or email me and i will get you all the info you need nice nice well thank you everybody who is watching right now um we are doing business opportunities every friday so this is one of three business opportunities that we have brought to you um inexpensive to get involved definitely um an opportunity where you can make some part-time income. It's all about what you put in it, into it, just like Miss Ashley said. I know that Miss Ashley is very um, welcoming. You can talk to her, you can ask questions. She's not gonna bark at you at all because I ask a lot of questions. <laughs> Oh, she's been very patient with me when I'm talking to her about, you know, Color Street and the business opportunity and so forth. So please reach out to Miss Ashley if you are interested in becoming a rep or you just want to bedazzle your nails with some Color Street designs. 
So thank you, Ms. Ashley, for joining us. And everybody have a great weekend. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. <laughs>